Okay, today we're going to show you how to fix your Netflix when it's not working on your Sharp Smart TV. Uh, this includes all models of the Sharp TVs, including the Aquos and the Roku versions. We're going to show you several methods uh, for fixing this problem. Um, if you stay with us all the way to the end of the video and try each of these methods, uh, there is a very high probability that uh, this problem will be solved for you. Okay, the first thing to try here is really the simplest, and in most cases, this one will actually work, so you might not even need to go on. Uh, just basically unplug your TV from the wall, wait about 60 seconds. Now, don't be impatient here. Wait the 60 seconds, and then plug it back in. This will reset your TV. Now, this is a lot different than switching the remote on and off, so do do it from the wall plug. Um, if this solves your problem, you're set. If not, let's go on to the next try. Okay, we're going to go into the settings menu on Netflix. Now, if you can't get to the settings menu because you're stuck on an error message in Netflix, I'll show you in a second how to still get to that settings menu. Uh, but let's go into the settings menu, and we're going to go down to get help. And then we're going to go to check your network. Here it's going to run a quick check of your network, let it go, and hopefully it should give you all the check marks there, and it should say everything successful. If you don't get uh, the connection successful and all the green check marks, uh, you most likely have a problem with your home network, so you want to try resetting your router or checking your internet connection, because it's not really a Netflix issue, it's an internet issue. If your internet is working, uh, you want to go ahead and click one step down there in the menu choice and click on Reload Netflix. Uh, this will basically then reload the Netflix app, um, and hopefully this should finally take care of your problem. One final note, if you could not get to the settings menu and you're just stuck at an error message like this and you see on the screen, uh, basically what you want to just do is click on More Details. If you click on that, it'll take you into the settings menu. That's our video for today. As always, thank you very much for watching, and please remember to subscribe.